Right, so this is playtest for Firefly on the Atari 2600 with Dylan. Hello. This is a loud music. What do you think about the sound? It's very loud. Is it off-putting or does it, you know, match the? It does not match the game at all. Doesn't it? Okay. I, I fell. You fell. I died. It's just loud. To be loud, it's like a, a noxiously loud noise. That's not background music. It draws your attention away from the game, and I, I don't mm. I can't focus on this. You can turn it down on the. Uh... No, no, that won't change anything. So you wouldn't say the music fits the game at all? No. How do I? How do I kill them? You're, you see you're shooting a bullet at them. Yeah, as soon as I get into, like... So you're saying the pacing's a bit too fast. There you go, I've got a ring. Would you say the pacing's a bit too fast? Yeah, probably. Like, the enemies seem to move really quickly out of nowhere. And then they just end you. It's a bit weird how there's three models, but they all die in one hit. I'm not even shooting here. Do I have to touch him? No, I don't touch him. I'm also confused about what the smiley face is. That's a, is that a sad face for another smiley face? So you think the game's a bit too random, like nothing really makes sense? Really, yeah, nothing makes sense at all. You're like, you've just been chucked in, you're like, why am I here, what am I doing, what are these enemy sprites? Yeah, I'm, trying to, I'm going to assume you're like a, a bug at a pond or something because you're a firefly mm. and there's other bugs that you're fighting, but I don't know any bugs that have got a smiley face on them. What do you think about the controls? The controls are simple to understand, arrow keys, space bar, unless that, there's more controls I don't know. Would you say they're consistent and they work? Yeah, they 100% 100, they 100 work. But they did, you, you didn't seem to be able to shoot the uh, the one on the other layout, but you had to just go past it. It wouldn't let me fire there. Mm. So the, the, it's a bit weird how you can't shoot if there's no enemies, which is why I thought it wasn't an enemy. Mm. I went to touch it and then I died. But I, wouldn't, I don't know if that's a problem with the controls or just as a game as a whole. Like with the layout of the controls, Araki space bikes, fine. Most people don't understand, they're quite used to that sort of control scheme. Mm. We said the game feels rewarding at all? No. Because you've collected items. They haven't done anything. Mm. So you're being rewarded, but it's not rewarding at all? No. But, okay. Would you like to answer some questions now that you've played the game to the extent that there is? Is that all there is? Yeah, you just keep repeating the layouts. Okay. So, did you enjoy the game at all? Um, not really, no. Is there a choice for you to make or is the game just too linear? It's too, you just go one direction and then it loops, so it's like you got about five different enemies to fight and that's it. Mm. So there's no way to complete it, you just keep doing the same thing over and over same again. Same thing over and over again. What, what sins did you specifically notice at first glance? Well, there was the, the controls. So there, was, there wasn't really a tutorial to tell me how to play, and it just kind of threw, it threw me in at the deep end pretty much with some pretty difficult enemies, um, and then the inconsistency with the controls of it not working in some layouts, or mm -hmm. when there's no enemies the button stops working. Okay. Did you like anything about the game? Um, I think I like the simplistic design of the sprites. But apart from that, everything was just really confusing, there was no explanation. Well, that's it. Thank you very much. You're welcome.